Uh, I would like to introduce uh, a member of the reunion committee, Michael Andresino, who will now go on to the next person. Thank you. I'd like to borrow a word from Elizabeth Warren, one of our states, uh, one of our senators. You built it. Do you understand just how unique WGBH is and was? Operating as a local independent station, hands a mouth at the beginning, a much bigger mouth at the end. Uh, operating as a network production unit, making programs at the level that equaled or exceeded those of the German, Japanese, and almost the BBC network. Uh, you did do this. This is what happened. There is no other local independent station in the world can deal with that kind of stuff. 60 years ago today, the first program on WGBH television was a program for children, which is most appropriate because that is some of the most significant programming that this or any other station can do. And one of the first voices heard was a young man named Tony Salatan, who is here today to sing for you the first song that was sung 60 years ago in one half of a defunct roller skating rink on 84 Mass Avenue, which we thought was really quite grand. Let me give you Tony Salatan. Thank you, Michael. You're gonna hold that? I got hold it. Okay. Yeah. It was what time? 5:30 in the afternoon. I uh, well, my memory is not to be trusted, but I believe it was 5:30. 5:30 to 6. So you were the very first person to ever show up? Yeah. Well, first person on the screen. <laughs> yeah, we made strange noises like that before we went on the air. Uh, so the, I think we had shown the uh, what do you call the thing that you put on the screen and it says WGBH? Yeah. 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 Yeah.